Brian Galing, Kelly Williams, Ames. Here's the Ames residential real estate update for November, 2021. These six graphs recap the Ames residential sales statistics for the month of October compared to the previous six years. Let's start by discussing new listings. Inventory is down. There were 46 new residential listings reported in Ames in October of 2021. This is down from last year in October when 75 homes were listed. This is 29 less new listings or a 39% decrease in new listings. The six year average for new listings in October is 57. In October of 2021, homes in Ames averaged 29 days on the market. This is 31 days quicker than October of 2020. The six year average for time on the market in Ames is 49 days. The average sales price for properties which sold in Ames in October of 2021 was $318,000. This is a $39,000 increase from last year alone. When looking back to 2015, the average sales price has increased by over $100,000. In October, Homes and Ames sold for 100.4% of their asking price. This now makes six out of the last seven months in 2021, where the average sales price has exceeded the original asking price. Over the past six years, the list price to sales price ratio has been 95.5%. The absorption rate is a statistic we used to evaluate the strength of the market. The absorption rate is measured in months. When we look at the current inventory and compare that to the current number of sales, it tells us how long it will take to flip the entire inventory. The absorption rate for October of 2021 was 1.3 months. This is the 10th consecutive month where our absorption rate has averaged below 1.4 months. In a neutral market, the absorption rate may vary from five to eight months. The 49 sales in Ames in October of 2021 is down significantly from the 73 sales of 2020. However, only down slightly from the six year average of 54 sales for the month of October. The Ames real estate market remains hot. If you are considering buying, selling, or investing in real estate, please call our real estate team today.